you go out clubbing, you have guys who hit your ass and you turn around and you can't see who it is because it's dark. Why? What, why? What right do they have to touch a girl like that? It's not okay. Recruiting officer Nikita has come to the First Dates restaurant on a personal recruitment drive to find her other half. So in ancient Greek times, the Greeks believed that you had one soulmate and that you're actually born as two people with four limbs and that you get separated. And that's kind of what love is to me, is that you find someone to bring back to. Hey there. Hi. How are you? Good, thank you. How are you? Very good. How's your day been yeah, so far? Yeah, pretty good. Pretty good. good. Yeah, pretty relaxed. I've been in love once in my life. Um, love is very exciting, but it can also be super heartbreaking too. Let's take a seat here. Cheers. Thank no you. Problem. Hi. How are you? Good, thank you. How are you? Yeah, really well. I do get called ditzy quite often. It's very easy to stereotype me into someone that I'm not, like a bimbo as such, because of my hair colour being super blonde and tanned and blue-eyed. Are we offering anything in particular? Uh, yeah, um, can I please try pavlova? Yeah, of course you can. I have had very sexual comments laid towards me. When you go out clubbing, you have guys who hit your ass and you turn around and you can't see who it is because it's dark. Why? What, why? What right do they have to touch a girl like that? It's not okay. How are you feeling? Yeah. Oh, shit. Pretty relaxed, actually. Relaxed? Yeah, more so than I thought I would be. But I'm like, what, like, why do people get nervous to try and impress someone else? Like, as long as you're content with yourself, if it works, it works, you know? For sure. It's a really good way to think, huh? Nikita's missing half be this gentleman, post-grad student Louis. My dream girl would probably be someone that plays computer games, likes history, is exciting, and can hold a really nice conversation. A lot of girls have an image in their head before they meet me and think that I'm too cool. I've had that a couple of times. I'm not sure where girls get that impression. I'm really just this down-to-earth kind of nerdy football player. You must be Louis. Yep. Good name. It's my name as well. Oh, really? Come on through. The first impression is obviously quite important. How they look, how they dress, how they hold themselves. <laughs> Follow me. I got quite excited because she's quite my type. Like, really... My type. I'm Nikita. Louis, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. How are you? Yeah, good, thanks. Good. Take a seat. Here already? No, I'm not here. <laughs> <laughs> to me, initial physical attraction is very important. Yeah, I definitely think he's quite good looking. Yeah. My dates aren't usually um, easy. my thing. <laughs> no, my thing or easy. <laughs> I've um, never done a blind date before. Really? So, yeah, yeah. No, nor have I. Like, I don't even uh, usually date, so... Really? So, a bit out of the comfort zone here? Absolutely. Me as well. We're both in the same boat there. I am very fond of accents, and Louis got a British accent, um, so it was it was definitely a turn-on, yeah. Cheers. Oh, yeah. To Cheers. a nervous first blind date. I'm actually not that nervous, I'm just more like... But you've started drinking, so fair enough. Yeah, do you know what? It doesn't take me a lot to get me drunk either. We should do the Bloody Mary oyster shot. <laughs> I don't know if I... The last time I had an oyster, I almost choked. I've never so. had an oyster. Really? Yeah, but I don't like mussels. I don't like, like shellfish. Similar to... Yeah, so yeah. So you should definitely not do that then. No, but you isn't this like the most spontaneous thing you can do, let alone? Yeah. So why not throw an oyster I'm not doing it unless you do it. OK, I'll do it as well. Legit? Yeah, I'll do it. But if I vomit, you have to vomit, so... OK. Deal. I studied psychology because I'm super interested in, in people's minds and what makes people tick and why they think the way they do and behave the way they do. It smells like tomato juice because of the Bloody Mary. Ready? Cheers. Oh my god, I swallowed that. Mm -mm. So swallow is what you usually do next. Don't tell me it's still in your mouth. Mm -hmm. Oh my days. Okay, I can't have you now. I'm sorry. Just swallow it. <laughs> this is why I struggled with it previously. Oh my goodness. So you good? I feel like I have the ocean in my mouth. Are you a bit of a night owl? Frustratingly I am. 
like throughout the week, it's like I just stay up late for no reason at all. Oh really? And just like okay. But I'm a bit of like a nerd. I play computer games as well. So I'll be like... Like LOL? I play LOL, LOL yes. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, I can't believe you know that. Oh my God, really I was not that. expecting that. <laughs> it was definitely a curveball uh, for Louis when I started bringing up um, different computer games that I know. I wouldn't have picked you to know anything. I don't, I don't play it. <laughs> <laughs> um, what about RuneScape? Oh my God, you're rolling back RuneScape. the years now. Yeah. Did you play? I've heard RuneScape, yeah. Really? Yeah, I'm Monday pretty sure Monday everyone like places. intermediate and primary school is playing RuneScape. <laughs> What would you say if I like I still was into club penguin? I'll be like yo. Let's play later. Let's do it. <laughs> what do you believe in that? I don't know. Because I'm I'm like a spiritual person, psychics and people who can speak with the dead say that ultimately, you know, you are a soul that gets born over and over again. Do you believe in the whole soulmate thing? One person? Uh, yeah. Yeah? yeah but you're so. only meant for one person? Yeah, I probably would agree. That but I think you can, like, love more than one person, mm. like, throughout your life. Mm. There's, like, that whole um, Greek mythology thing where... Like, Wait, I think I know what you're about to say. When it's, like, the two people are split apart. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then you, like, have to, like, travel the whole world and, like, try and find Search for them. the other part of you. I don't, I don't think I believe in soulmates. When she talked about soulmates, it's not something that I would really talk about on the first date, even the first few dates. But that was one of the things that she was just so forward and she would just say what she was thinking. Okay. Should we go? That's Hannah and I. I'm gonna pay half. No, 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 no. No, 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 no please, no, no, like, no. let me. No, please. No, no, no. Louis isn't my typical type. Um, my usual type is, is tall, dark haired, mm. bit of facial hair, tan skin. Don't, just please don't worry, I'm gonna pay. Are you sure? Yeah, 100%. Oh. Definitely. Are you sure? Because dead serious right now. Oh, that's really sweet. Thank you. No problem. I would definitely like to see her again, yes. <laughs> Down. She's down, I'm down. Okay. So we're both down. <laughs> I think that's a yes. That's a yes. <laughs> um, so, should we go have a coffee? Yeah. Okay. <laughs>